Well, the Beatles arrived in New York today and advanced almost to the Hudson. The four English musical stars with their pudding bowl haircuts were greeted by about 4,000 shrieking teenagers at Kennedy Airport and mobbed by another large group of juveniles when they got to the Plaza Hotel. All day long, some local disc jockeys had been encouraging truancy with repeated announcements of the Beatles' travel plans, flight number, and estimated time of arrival. British journalists tell us that the record company had 16 press agents handling the arrival, but we wouldn't know much about that. However, like a good little news organization, we sent three camera crews to stand among the shrieking youngsters and record the sights and sounds for posterity. Our film crews acquitted themselves with customary skill and ingenuity. The pictures were very good, but someone asked what the fuss was about, and we found we had no answer. So, good night for NBC News.